Have you ever come across a graphic in Canva that you really want to use, but it isn't your brand colors? Maybe the image is perfect for what you need, but it's not the right colors. Well, in this video, I'm gonna show you exactly how you can change the colors so you can turn that graphic into your brand colors. All right, so we're looking in Canva. We found some cool graphics we wanna use and we wanna make sure that it matches our branding. Now, sometimes you'll find that perfect graphic. It's just right, but it's not in your colors. So what can you do about that? Well, some graphics, for example, this one, straight away when you've clicked on that and put it in your file, you can see up here, you can instantly change the colors. So you can straight away go in, click on each of these and change each of them to brand colors. And straight away, you've got something that's on brand for you. However, that's not the case for every single graphic. So I'm going to show you what to do as a workaround for the times where you're not able to do this. So let's choose another graphic where you can't. So for example, this cash register, say you just love the design. It's a great graphic. You really want to use it, but they are not your brand colors. What can you do about this? Well, the way we can make it look more in brand is to click on it, go to edit photo, and then we're going to go here to duotone. Now what you're going to do is pick the one that's closest to what you're after. So maybe you want to use your brand colors that are blue. So we can just click on this blue one. What it's going to do here is actually put two colors up, highlights and shadows. Now it does limit us to just two colors. So it is a little bit of restriction there, but at least we can get it closer to making it look on brand. So what we can do is choose highlight and choose our first brand color and then go to shadow and choose the next brand color. Now, if you choose two very different colors, this is gonna sort of mix them together and that's not gonna look quite so good. So what you wanna do is choose just one hue. So let's say we wanna choose blue and we're just gonna choose maybe a light version of our blue, our on brand blue and a dark version of our blue. So you're basically choosing one brand color you have and the light version and the dark version of that color. And then here we go, we've changed it to our brand colors. Now, obviously it's not super dynamic because it's basically just one color using light version and dark version, but at least it does now make this more on brand. But if you really wanted to add more color into it, you could of course use things like shapes and other things to add on top of this graphic. So we could, for maybe make the coins, we could just go get some circles and we could put them in on top and change them to another color. If you wanna just add a splash of other color to it, for example. So you could always do something like that. Or you could go and find other elements that you can change. So let's go and put in coins. And let's see if there's anywhere we can straight out edit the color. Or again, you could just use Duotone again and just change that particular element. So we could grab these coins. As you can see here, it's not gonna let us. So we could go to edit photo again, back to Duotone. And maybe we want these ones to be that corally color. So we can adjust it to make it more our brand colors. Shrink it down. And we can put it on top just to add more color to it. So you can always do something like that, where if you feel like, oh, that's very flat, I've now got it on brand, so that's great. But I really wanted a little bit more color in it. Think about how you can add a color by, you know, adding shapes on top or adding other graphics on top to throw a little bit more color into it so that you create something that is that perfect image you're after, but now it's on brand and suits the rest of your graphic. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and if you'd like to learn more about using Canva and also about branding and graphic design for your business, make sure you subscribe to this channel and I'll see you next time.